things do not go to only this extent, Your Lordship. As far as Your Lordship, this issue was also raised in the state of uh, Hyderabad and Your Lordship, in the, sorry, Your Lordship, the state of Telangana and Your Lordship, the state of Kerala, Your Lordship. Huh. There also the bodies were covered, Your Lordship. But the fact was that the administration and the functioning was to see whether they were independent of the government or not, Your Lordship. Mm -hmm. Here, Your Lordship, the administrator, Your Lordship, he is the main authority who functions on behalf of the instructions given by the managing committee, Your Lordship. Uh -huh. That administrator is... Your Lordship, uh, um, Your Lordship, I may be given time to produce this... No, no, no. You should have filed it. Yes, Lordship. But Your Lordship, I have made my submissions in para number 5.2, Your Lordship. What is the question? Maa Dev, Shadra Devi Mandir Praman Samiti Mahiya Jila Satna. अधिनियम प्रभावी होने के पश्चात पूर्व से कार्यरत निकाय कर्मचारियों का संविलियन का प्रस्ताव अप्लाई गई प्रक्रिया की समस्त मस्ती निकाय के कार्य में कार्यरत कर्मचारियों को स्थाई किए जाने का प्रस्ताव अप्लाई गई प्रक्रिया निकाय में कार्यरत कर्मचारियों के समूह बीमा योजना के अंतर्गत जमा की गई राशि और शासन के कोष में जमा किए जाने की रसीद चालान संपूर्ण ब्यौरे की राशि ईपीएफ योजना के अंतर्गत जमा की गई राशि का महावार तो आप ईपीएफ अगर भी काटते हैं मध्य प्रदेश वृत्ति कर नियम उन्नीस के अनुसार 2005 से इक्कीस तक की गई कटौती राशि कर्मचारी के नाम पदनाम वेतनमान तो व्हाट इज रॉन्ग इन इट वाई यूर शाई ऑफ गिविंग दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन यू लॉर्डशिप द फैक्ट इज दैट that your lordship the fact is that these people are really filing the applications with an intention to blackmail often now and then who can blackmail a goddess lordship if, if you are if your work is pious yes your lordship. and it is in furtherance of the object of the god yes sir. or the goddess who can blackmail you that means that in the name of the god or goddess there is some hanky fanky going on which you want to suppress no, Your Lordship, the problem is, uh, it is not because of that the information is not being supplied, but Your Lordship, the, the, the fact is that this, now I am taking my petition also, that the frivolous RTI applications are being How it is frivolous? I will dismiss, I will allow your petition, dismiss their claim immediately. How it is frivolous? Uh, have you, are you not making reductions towards the professional tax? Vritti kar niyam kya hai, hai na professional tax. Are you not depositing amounts under employees provident fund scheme? Are you not taking making contribution towards group insurance policy? Have you not regularized the employees? All these things they come in public domain. Merely and especially once your constitution is under the state act. Your Lordship, that is what I was trying to submit before Lordships. Mm -hmm. That your that the there is a judgment of the High Court. Did you know? That I have submitted in the petition itself. Uh, page number. Page number. And uh, one is a judgment of your Lordship of the State of Kerala, your Lordship. Uh, that okay, uh, what your information mangi thi. Lordship, page number 48 in extra P6. Ah, but here. Your Lordship, para number 18. Para 18, yes. Yes, Your Lordship. Page number 53. Yes. Your Lordship, in so far as the question of control is concerned, while the government has the power to supersede the MDB, it cannot substitute itself for the MDB and it cannot be the MDB. The governmental control, if any, as part of the revisional power or otherwise is only statutory control, the exercise of which always depends upon the existence of jurisdictional facts, which would trigger the exercise of such statutory control. Such statutory controls which are regulatory or even adjudicatory. 2H ko kaan consider kiya hai inhoonne? Kerala High Court ne 2H C ko kaan consider kiya hai? Ki 2H C jo hai? If that is there in the para number, your lordship, 20. Para 20, yes, sir. Para 20, let us read para 20. Yes, sir. 
Uh, this takes us to the further submission of the learned senior government leader that the temples to which HR and CE Act applies are public temples and the uh, temple advisory committee are public authorities for the purpose of RTI since, since they are constituted as per the statutory provisions in HR and CE Act. HR and CE Act? Hindu religious and charitable yes. establishments yes. hoga, mein, Yes. Huh? Yes. Ah, uh, in Hindu Religious and Charitable Endowments Act, Act. Yes, sir. Uh, since they are constituted as per the provisions in HR and CE Act, and it needs to be ensured that they are amenable to the provisions of the RTI Act as they are predominantly involved uh, uh, in raising funds by collection from public for the purpose and matters in connection with the temples. The temple advisory committees are conceived and constituted in terms of the statutory provisions. Section 14 of the HR and CE Act provides that the temple advisory committee may be constituted for each temple, not inconsistent with the customs and practices for the purposes of ensuring adequate participation of Hindu devotees. Therefore, the provision is only an enabling one and the purpose of such a provision is to generate adequate participation of Hindu devotees. It is further provided that the composition of the temple advisory committee shall be in such a manner as may be prescribed and the committee is formed under uh, that provision shall be approved by the board. Therefore, the temple advisory committee is not an extended limb uh, of, or office of the MDB. It is not constituted by M the MDB, but gets constituted as a committee ensuring adequate participation of... Committee can because it was not... Here also, your lordship, it is committee only. No, no. Which committee? Ye Ma Sharda Devi uh, Managing Committee. Managing Committee, hai na? Ji, ji. Uska to constitution statute se hua hai na? Inhone to yahan ye distinguish kiya hai kyunki committee jo hai wo statutory nahi hai. Isliye uski jankari nahi di ja sakti. To Lordship, I may be permitted to file the act also because why I am seeking Lordship because I may be also. Shubhna Matai. Pravanshu Shukla. Pravanshu Shukla not able to answer basic query of this court that when section 2H C, within bracket C of the Right to Information Act covers any body or institution established or constituted by any other law made by state legislature as a public authority and then when Petitioner is a creation of Ma Sharda Devi. Kya naam hai sector? Ma Sharda Devi Managing. Uh, uh, MP Ma Sharda Devi Mandir Adhiniyam 2002. Madhya Pradesh Ma Sharda Devi Adhiniyam Mandir Adhiniyam 2002. Then how the judgment of Kerala High Court in AC Bhanuni alias if page 48 will be will be applicable to the facts and circumstances of this case place for time to file complete set of the act and the rules so also the constitution of the board and the functions of the board in regard to reduction of epf group insurance regularization of employees etc and who is the authority and whether government has any say in the matter of regularization of these employees or not let complete record be filed within 10 days with this case on 4 January 2023. Your Lordship, the actually administrator is Ill, suffering from ailments and he is in Delhi. Maybe I may be taking some more time. If some fixed date may be given, Your Lordship. Fixed date, date 4 January. Lordship, if he is not in Delhi. Collector, what is your name? Your Lordship. Collector, what is your name? No, no, Your Lordship. He is the SDM, Your Lordship. Okay, come on. If there is someone else, there will be no one else. Another one submission will not this position. He is very sorry. I find interest. No, no, no. 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 This petition has been preferred through Office of Superintendent without reservation also. Three, three, three. President is May, May, and the session six. Three, three, three. So, IR should not be continued, why not? Now, IR continue, but it's not IR to continue. And 4th January 2023. Yes, sir. 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 Y